Hey, my friends, my friends, what's going on? Hey, it's Gene. Get up and get out with Gene. Hey, there's a little echo in here. Hey, I found this spot. I'm sure plenty in Wilmington have seen it before. Uh, normally when I'm on this old train bridge, which is right out here, I can see this building. I'm like, I gotta get over there and do a video sometime. So I drove over here this morning to do a video for you. Thank you for jumping on. How are we doing? I'm sorry it's not a, a, a beautiful view of the lake or whatever, but I just thought all the graffiti in the old building makes a nice backdrop here. So I just wanted to uh, use it. And I'm lucky enough to be in the area that I'm in and I have plenty of scenery to use, right? So how are we doing this morning? Are you getting up and getting out? Are you doing your thing? Are you doing it today? Hey, listen. Hey, thank you, Julia. This is a cool background. I'm sure you've probably seen I don't even know what the name of this old building is, but it's actually a building with no roof and uh, whatever. It's over around 5th Street in Wilmington uh, near the uh, One Tree Hill Bridge. That's what it is right by there. But anyways, okay, so let's get to it. Give and give again. I was thinking about this. Um, we were talking about it. Our pastor was talking about it in church this weekend, this Sunday, about the things that, and I don't mean to get all religious. It's just using this topic here. But the things that Jesus did for his apostles, even knowing that he was going to die and be, you know, just put to death the way he was, the things that he did, still washing the feet of Peter. You know, I was thinking about this today that I don't have much, but whenever I can give, I like to give. And I think that's the best thing. If anytime you're struggling, and I've talked about this plenty of times in the past, anytime you're struggling, the best thing to do is let go of your ego. Nothing that you have is yours. Nothing that you have is yours. Do you hear that? Nothing that you have is yours. Even that beautiful truck. I was thinking about, I was very uh, enamored with my beautiful truck. It's parked out there. But, uh, and I got a couple of scratches on it from however, and I got really mad about it. And then I, I just let it get to me and I festered on it. It's like, how could somebody do that to my truck? My truck, my truck, how could somebody do that? And I just started thinking, you know, I need to let that go. A, it's not my truck, it's not paid for yet. B, it's not mine, it's not mine at all. Nothing in this world is mine. So anything that I have a grasp of, even for a moment, I can let go of to give to somebody else even for a moment. You know, I had read this, um, this quote, I think it was a quote, yeah, that said, if somebody steals a shirt off your back, give them your coat too. And I believe Jesus said that also. I'm sorry I'm getting really religious today. It's Monday, I had church yesterday, I'm sorry. Hey, get over it. But anyways, you know, if somebody steals your shirt, give them your coat. So I was thinking about that with my truck. If somebody damages it, it's not mine. It's just a truck. It's just this building. I'm sure this building brought great joy to people who worked here and now it's gone. It's just, it, it never, I don't know. It, you can't hold on to anything. You need to let go. The ego holds on to many things. I don't know if you get that or not. The ego holds on to many things. And if you can lose your ego, you can let go of things that aren't yours that you can give to the next person. This jacket right now, if I saw a homeless person, I would give it to them. I'd be cold in my t-shirt and I'd just go get back in my truck and uh, be warm, right? My truck. <laughs> yes, Reed. Yes, 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 yes. I agree with my buddy Reed. I'm sorry, this is Facebook Live, so if I call anybody out, that's why, because people are commenting, and I love that. Um, my buddy Reed said, never worry about religion with the topic, the world is only temporary. That is true. This world that we're living in is only temporary. We're not taking any of this with us when we go to the grave. You know, I, I see like people holding on to things and holding on to things. I understand sen sentimental things or something that reminds you of another person, that type of thing. But when we die, we die. You know, whatever happens in the afterlife happens in the afterlife, but I ain't taking that truck with me. You know, it ain't going in the grave with me. This hat's not going in the grave, this jacket, you know, my keys, my wallet, you know, everything in it's not going with me when I go. You know, I don't, I'm not trying to sound morbid here or anything, but you gotta learn to give, give and give again, give and give again, give and give again. You know, I want you to think about that today if you could, you know, I know some of us are struggling and as you're struggling, you know, give what you can, give what you can. That's the best way to help yourself is to help others. You know, the best way to help yourself is help others. Did you hear that? The best way to help yourself and your ego <laughs> is to help others, right? You know, so do what you gotta do today. If you can give in any way, in any way, you know, it's not Thanksgiving this month and we're not gonna wait till November, right? We're gonna do it today. Give and give again. I want you to try that 
today, all right? Share this with a friend. Give it to a friend. Maybe you can't speak to a friend the way I'm able to just put this out here today. You know, you can share this video, share my other videos, get by my website, Google Gene, check that out, all right? Let's see, Julia said something. I gotta hit the see more button. Oh, there's a bunch there. Um, yep, 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 yep. <laughs> That's where I got it from, Julia, is uh, letting go of attachments and letting go of expectations. That's part of our ego is what holds on to those attachments and expectations. So we gotta get rid of those, you know? And if you have nothing to give, give love. That's what Julia says here. If you have nothing to give, give love. Give of yourself, give of your heart. You know what I mean? Try that today, all right? I'm gonna jump off of here, go get warm in my truck. <laughs> my truck, right? <laughs> but give love today, give what you can, give to another. Just. Love each other, all right? Have a good day. Peace and chicken grease. See ya.